Hi everyone, I'm Matt Randalls. I'm just going to sh show you a short demonstration on how I clip a concave front shoe out of 7 8 3 8 with a bob punch. So, as regards posture and with the way I stand behind the anvil, I hold my shoe 90 degrees to my tongs. I like to work just alongside the bick and I can stand square to the anvil, stepping sideways a little bit so my right hand side of my body and my hammer are completely in line with where I want to draw my clip out. So I'm not stood to one side, drawing the clip across, so obviously it'll draw my clip sideways. So this is how I go about drawing a clip and having my tongs in that position to the shoe helps me having no foul play against the anvil and I can rotate the shoe up and down. Okay, so my bob punch is an old stud punch that I've radiused up and it produces me a nice even bubble to make it a lot easier to draw a good strong clip out of. So I put my bob punch in the required position, I lean my hand back a touch and I drive it down to the base of the shoe. And I'll turn it over, flatten the foot bearing surface off. I line it up 90 degrees, hold the top edge of the concave section above the edge of the anvil. I hold my shoe slightly flatter and then rotate it so it goes square into the anvil. I'm going to drive in with a flat of my hammer. I'm going to draw a flat so it pulls the top edge over. So I've now drawn the top edge of the section over. I've not dragged too much of the section down. And I've, remember, when I start drawing the rest of the clip out, I'm going to go in with the heel of my hammer and then lighten off. And as they do that, I'm going to rotate, take my shoe around a little bit as well. Lighten off as you get towards the tip of the clip. Still going in heel first with my hammer. I've got the bulk of my material in the right place, and now we're just going to go over the flat, completely flat, and uh, tidy the hammer marks out. So I've drawn my clip out, I've got a nice strong base. I'm just going to lay it on over the bick of the anvil. Firstly, I'm just going to level the foot bearing surface up behind the clip while I can get to it, because if I do that, after I've laid my clip on, I've got more chance of catching the edge of the clip and folding it over. So do that now. Cut in at each side of the clip, like so. Now lay the clip on, laying the inside of the concave web on the bick. Hit the clip flat from the base. And then tidy it in at 90 degrees. So that's my concave clip on 7 8 3 8 using a round bob punch. Thank you.